Tom Waits' is Real Gone. Uh, for me, it was a bit of a game changer as an album. I only had listened to Small Change prior to that. But this is industrial with heavy beats, but just some seriously good stuff on it. Particularly my favorite song was Hoist That Rag. Uh, it's, just, it's just so good. It's got the best guitar solo I've ever heard. So this is the Blade Runner soundtrack by Vangelis. It's full of like these really like icy sort of synthesizers that sort of just trickle down and arpeggiators and whatnot. And um, of course Vangelis is a, a legendary composer. Think Tank by Blur. It's so textured. It's got this deep melancholy throughout the whole album, which is not really something that they dealt with before. Uh, the artwork's by Banksy, which is pretty cool. And yeah, it's, it's definitely top stuff. A bit of Dickie D, so uh, Dick Diver, Melbourne, Florida. I listened to this one a couple of weeks ago and it's just been on repeat, pretty much. It's got great horn sections, they're all just really good tracks. Probably especially uh, track number two, You're in Pitches. It's, uh, it's a bloody good track, that one. It's, it's really sort of nostalgic sounding. So this guy's called Georgie Fame. He was an uh, English uh, soul and blues singer in the 1960s. He wrote banger after banger. He actually has a song that's kind of reworked by Slick Rick, one of uh, my personal favorite rappers. And uh, it's, it's sitting in a park in the way that Slick Rick changes it to the way that Georgie Fame plays it. Both hold their own merit and fantastic. Good artist to listen to. Listen to the